Hey guys, so today we're making some buttermilk pound cake. Please make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let's get started with the recipe. So we're going to start by adding in some butter and some butter flavored shortening. And so this is my husband helping us out in the kitchen today. And so we're just adding in some granulated sugar. And then you're going to let this cream together for about five or six minutes until it is well incorporated. And y'all, I am so excited. I got me a kitchen aid for Mother's Day. And so now we are just adding in one egg at a time. It's a total of four eggs, but you're going to add it in one at a time and let it fully incorporate before adding in the next egg. But y'all... You know, usually I use my handheld mixer, which, you know, gets the job done. But you can really tell the difference when you use, you know, um, a mixer such as a kitchen aid like this. It's a game changer. And so next we're going to add in some vanilla extract as well as some lemon extract. And so y'all don't judge us, but this is like our second cake making, like second time using this mixer. To, and this is the second pound cake that we've made and that's you know that just goes to show like you really get excited to bake when you have you know good good equipment and so we're, we added in some all-purpose flour and we're just going to alternate that with some buttermilk because this is a buttermilk pound cake and so um i will be sure to list all of the ingredients in the dish description box below with the measurements but this recipe is from that cookbook that my mom bought me the African American children's cookbook and they have some really good recipes in there and so this pound cake the texture is a little bit different I will say that it is lighter but it still has really good flavor you know pound cake can be kind of dense sometimes but it has really good flavor and so we're just spraying our bunt pan and shout out to my mom for this bunt pan and we're going to add in our batter you know beat it up on the counter a little bit and then you're going to put it in a 325 degree oven for about an hour and 10 minutes hour 15 minutes and you're going to let it cool in the pan until you're able to touch the pan until it's, you know, until you're able to touch it. And then you're going to flip it out of the pan. And so we are just making some icing for this delicious cake. And so we have some cream cheese, some powdered sugar, some vanilla extract. And then we're going to add in some heavy cream, a little bit of milk. And we're just going to mix all of this together. And you can adjust the flavor of your icing. Um, be sure to taste it and, you know, kind of mix it around with your spatula to get the consistency right. Um, you do want to be able to drizzle it on your cake, but you don't want it to be so thin that it runs off of it completely. And so we are just pouring that delicious icing on this delicious buttermilk pound cake. Y'all, this was so good. We had also made a, a 7 up pound cake. I did not record that, but I am more than willing to make another one. This is the finished product. Please make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. See you next time. Bye.